Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to a- another episode of Arts by Janelle. <laughs> I don't normally do it like that. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Janelle and you guys are the ABG squads. If you're new here, please to subscribe and hit that notification bell. That way, you will not miss out on any of my future videos. If you're new or not, please leave a like on this video and comment and share. Guys, I have the cartridge paper that which I'm going to be painting on. But first, I'm going to be applying the sketch, just like a flimsy piece of paper, onto the cartridge paper. And the reason why I'm not using this is because I believe that the paint will probably tear this paper. So I'm going to use the cartridge paper instead, which is much thicker. But to transfer the sketch onto the cartridge paper, I'm going to be using a carbon paper that which I made. Could have buy none, could have run to no, you know, store go buy none. So I just made it by just using like paper and just using drawing pencil to just shade it pitch black. So what I will do is to turn this carbon paper onto the area like this which i want the drawing to be applied onto and then i will have the this on top but i'm going to tape it down so you know to secure it i already have my tapes rolled up so i'm just going to put it at the edge yeah the drawing won't need to be applied to the edge of this paper so i'm good by just this and put it right at the edge there so you see right at the edge Apply the next one under here. Apply the next one there. So, next one here. So, and another one at the other corner. It's perfect and there you go now make sure it's made flat all right now I'm going to be taping on this paper like so okay okay <laughs> so i have it putting the tape at each edge i'm going to basically just trace over my lines and then you see it being applied onto the other paper you'll see a quick time lapse of me tracing the lines so you guys are probably like why do you not choose to paint a fish <laughs> out of every other animal or thing to paint a fish <laughs> well this is actually a requested artwork requested art piece for a customer zine so the well, he's kind of a friend. Yeah, he's a friend and he's also a YouTuber from the Real Fishing Kings of Jamaica. And basically, you know, he loves the underground scenery, the fishes, beautiful, you know, fish, the, yeah, cool, pretty something in the under the water. Yeah, that's just his passion. So he said that he would like a fish to be painted for his birthday, like a painting of a fish. And so I came up with the idea to paint a fighting fish, which I hope you guys would love it, especially my use of colors. So this is something that I highly recommend. Like, look how easy. Like, the sketch before was just literally me sketching it, not trying to draw it perfectly. But it came out perfect, and I was like, I'm not going to draw this over again. So... Might as well just trace it. Oh, 
okay let's paint okay so as you can see for this fighting fish I am using different shades of colors different shades of red 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 orange and a orange so I'm just like blending in each color to make it look you know natural and thing but before I really get into like demonstrating or like really talking about what I'm painting and how I'm painting it while you watch it I can just like tell you what this fish is like what is a fighting fish I mean like what is it <laughs> so it's also called betta fish right and they are native to Asia where they live in the shallow water of marshes, ponds or slow moving streams. The male bettas are devoted fathers who build bubble nests for their young with their with their mouth what the hell <laughs> and fiercely protect their babies from predators. Okay, just like us, of course. So the betta fish are Dior, well, Dior now, Dior now, yeah, they're Dior now. That means they're active during the day and they sleep at night, requiring darkness to get a good night's rest. Here it says that they were created in Thailand and a vast majority is sold to the US and these fishes are mostly like used as pets or sold as pets. Yeah. They're kind of tiny, you know. Like goldfish size. I don't think they get any bigger. They probably do. I'm just assuming. But they are they have variety, you know, they have variety shades and colors and they're just so, you know, just so beautiful, like a ball gown, you know, a ball gown. Somebody having a ball gown and dressed us flowy under the water. Yeah, man, them vibes. <laughs> okay, so now that I have explained what a better fish or fainting fish is, I think we should have like a little chit chat. So, I want, I like to know like the type of videos you guys love the most for my channel i mean yes like the main reason why i started this channel is to basically produce art like to show you guys you know my talent and hoping that it motivates you to show yours as well whether it's painting or singing or whatever you know but i you know kind of find it interesting also to make content for everyone you know like some form of entertainment like the pranks or the vlogs or the challenges and i'd like to hear from you guys like what type of videos do you love the most from my channel so just comment your answer right now in the comment section right now just to add that it's been a very long time since I painted like I think the last time I painted was when I was in six farm my last painting was probably was probably in the month of February last year February like that's how long I've painted <laughs> and I missed it so much so yeah, it felt so great painting this fish because like when I'm painting I just feel relaxed and free and it, it's relaxing when like you're creating art like you're creating something unique beautiful colors being spread across the paper and you form it so beautifully to create something and that's art you know that's art. You should definitely try it. <laughs> you should definitely try it. At least look at what I'm doing and attempt attempt it. And send me your picture on Instagram 
at Arts by Janelle right in the corner there or even my personal page at Janelle. And I'll be glad to answer you. I answer my DMs, guys. I do. And yes, this is actually my first time painting a fish. My first time painting a fish. First time drawing a lie. I draw fish before, but you know them little manga skin fish, they like it. Just uh, try something, you know. But I really did put out my all in this. Well, not my all, but I put out a lot in it. And I do think that it could be more detailed. Like, I know that it could be. But this is great, you know. Like, I really love this. In fact, because it's my first time painting a fish. So, big up to myself. You see me? Big up, big up, big up. <laughs> but yeah, you should definitely try it and DM me your painting on Instagram. I also hope that you guys are having a happy new year. And, like, how are you adjusting to COVID? Like, I'm trying online classes starting college online and having all my classes online and yep yep things have to happen you know like that's just life things happen and you have to be accustomed to changes and thing but a lot of good came out of it a lot of good came out of it but how are you guys dealing with it and yeah, I just hope for nothing but prosperity and blessings, showers of blessings, success, you know, to come your way this year. All you have to do is just put in the hard work, you see me? From you put in hard work, then success is going to come. Slow progress is still progress. So even when you realize that nobody now see like, like what you're doing, you keep on trying and trying and nobody now recognize what you're doing. Like just keep on pushing because somebody see it, you see me? Somebody see it. So just keep on grinding, keep on hustling, keep on doing you, do whatever you do best and just leave it to God. Right, this so. <laughs> Yeah, so how do I feel about this painting? I believe that it came out pretty decent and detailed and everything. Even the gloss on the eyelid. Eyelid, the eyelid, them up. Eyelid, them. Yeah. yeah, the top part of the eyelid. So, yeah, you can still look a gloss. Make it look like it's a bulge. Like, that's details. So, right now, I'm just giving it like a little splattering to just... Yeah, from if you know me, you don't know say like from your paint, like it's splattering though in there, I'm not gonna feel like my paint. Honestly, like the splattering does make it pop more. Splattering is like you're giving something sprinkles or glitters. It just shines more and I just had to put I just had to do it. I had to, I had to. I had to. So yeah. Around him is you know water. But yeah, sprinkles then are my water, you see me? <laughs> yeah, my water. So yeah, close up view. I hope that you enjoy this video as much as how I did. I hope that you like the painting as much as how I did. And I will definitely be putting out more art content because I really be, you know, laid back with the paintings and the drawings. I don't know why, you know, no say school have me away. So I'm just doing what I can for you guys. Like, oh my god, the the the, the details and the bright colours. This is why I love acrylic paint, guys. Definitely paint with acrylic paint because it's just so glossy. So I loved my different mixtures of colours, the orange, the yellow, the red being blended in, the blue, the yellow, the green, the scales. The scales just form out perfectly. I don't know if you see the scales like under the fins right there. The fin is actually like a little transparent thing. So it kind of look light underneath. But scales are under there if you can see the little details I'm putting right there. So. But yeah, it's a good painting and I honestly love it. I love it and I'm proud of myself and 
I'm sure that you guys should be proud of yourselves as well. Just try the painting. Just try it. Nobody tell yourself so you can't do it. Just try it and let me know how it goes, okay? Alright, so here you go. Happy early birthday. Thank you. The details and everything. No. Oh, come here, class. <laughs> <laughs> no, I love not. it. I love it. Thank you. So, why is something there? Why am I walking? Oh, let me see it now. But it's too dark, though. That's, that's why I'm going to act right there. Okay, should I put the quiet back on? Yeah. I'm going to love it. Thank you. Yeah. Don't forget to follow my Instagram pages. And until next time, bye bye Guys, I almost forgot. Please to subscribe to Malik and Kelly. And subscribe to Mari Official. Please to tell them that I sent you guys, okay?